bicycle. I mean, we're talking. You know, not only rats. So cool. anyway, all right. Twenty toys will then be put on display at the museum. Okay. Go. Right, you should go on display right now. Here we go. Woo! We've got Chef Doug. All right. Hey, good. How are you doing? Fine, thanks. All right. So we are talking about a twenty-year. Well, you've been a chef for twenty years, but this is a family recipe. All right. It goes back to my family over sixty years. It's a oh my gosh. From Sheridan, Indiana. Mm -hmm. uh, See, that's my uh, mother and father. Uh -huh. uh, that's their picture from World War II. Aww. And to, uh, Beautiful couple. To their right were uh, my uh, grandmother, uh, Marie Red, and her husband, uh, John Red. He was a doctor in the for 50 years. Oh, no kidding. Yeah. You, you know, and that's interesting that what's been handed down as far as a family recipe is salad dressing. i got to admit, most family recipes are, well, maybe a, a meatloaf recipe. or uh, and Do you have those as well? Or is well, it I, I do, but I, I want to get this done, done for many years.
these recipes uh, you're going to give us, and we're going to put that on IndieStyle.tv, right? Right. And where can people go to get a bottle of this salad dressing? Well, it's for sale in, uh, in town in specialty stores. It's on my yeah. website, uh, yourchefstore.com, on the home page. There will be a list of stores where you can buy it locally. All right, sounds good. And Chef, you're not going away. You're going to make some more salads for us. No, I have up, right? two very special salads in the next segment. All right, look forward to it. Guys, stick around because next up we're going to talk about, hey, why not visit Chicago? It's not that far away. Just get in your car and drive. Also, we're going to meet a Hoosier native motivational speaker. Hey, you feeling good and pumped up this morning. Hey, anyway, scattered thunderstorms here. I think the best chance is the rain is tomorrow afternoon into Thursday, and then the heat comes back in. Look at that. Sunday, 98 degrees, 100 by next month. No, I don't want to look at it. That's just it. That's the whole point. I don't want to no, look at done, it. We're done. We're done. We're done. We're done. All right. Yeah, well, wool was a wick away fabric back in 1880, whatever. I'm in the kitchen still with Chef Doug. Been putting up, and you've been stretching uh, the, the perceived limitations of salad dressing. Awesome. Had some great salads earlier, and you're going you're gonna to continue. What's this? We call it fire and ice? Fire and ice is a very interesting recipe with uh, watermelon and arugula. What okay. we're going to do here is plate this up. We'll do a little arugula on the plate first. Arugula is a great green from. Well, not that I want to tick off the uh, oh, iceberg green. lettuce floppy, <laughs> but if you're going to go greens, mm -hmm. get some greens with some you know, nutritional content. Something's like, oh, hey. It's like, oh, that's really I, good. I, I don't feel the need to mash it all in. 